guys, it's Tabitha with PDP Dog Sports, and I've had a lot of requests lately of how to properly fit your dog in a harness. We're going to go over a couple of different harnesses. They're all going to be made by Nonstop Dog Wear. It's a line that we carry, so it's a line we're comfortable with. It's a line that we use with our dogs. Our perfect little demo dog today is going to be Bumble. Girl. So Bumble's already fitted for this line. It is a line that we use. So I've got the already kind of the inside. I know exactly which ones are going to fit my dog. But a few cute things that we need, cute things we need to go over before we start fitting our dogs is a couple little anatomy points that you're going to be looking for when you're fitting your dog with a harness. So Bumble, sit. This is your dog's breastbone. You need to find exactly where the top of your dog's breastbone is. It's going to be very important. I'll show you why later. Also, on your dog's neck, where, here, you turn your head. Let's see if I can get to the other side. Maybe you can see it a little bit more clearly. Um, turn, turn. Good girl. Where the top of their shoulder blade is. Again, these are things you're gonna need to just kind of feel for your dog, find exactly where it is. It's gonna be very important later while you're fitting your dog for a harness. So we're gonna start with the ultra harness. This is what we use when we're out running. We, this is not a harness that's made for pulling. So I see a lot of people using it when you're bike joring and that kind of stuff. If your dog is running to the side of you, you can use it. If your dog is actively in the front of you, I personally would not use this for any kind of pulling. I like it with my bigger dogs. I like the nice broad breastplate that it has. And I like the fact that it's adjustable in four different points. So I already know Bumble is an extra large. That's what's going to fit. Ironically, this is the same size because of the way that adjusts that my really big boy does. Where's so I'm gonna pop this on her and I cheated, it's already adjusted down for Bumble. So you're gonna see, okay, stand stay. Good girl. You cannot see the top of my dog's breastbone. It's not gonna come down, it's not gonna expose her breastbone while she's running, it's gonna keep her nice and covered. Here's the important part. See how it sits up on her shoulder blade? It's not sagging off one side. So when she's pulling or running, I mean, they are gonna pull a little bit when you're running, but this should not be active pulling, pulling. It is not, let me see if you can see her armpit. Come here, step. Oh, good job. It's not rubbing on her armpit. It's firm enough behind, but it's also tight enough. So she is just barely an extra large. I'm going to put a large on her and I'm going to show you how the large rubs in her armpit. Great Danes are really difficult to fix, fit for these things. Um, they're not designed for giant breed dogs. They're not designed for big, broad dogs. Um, Nonstop Dog Wear has done an amazing job at making them very adjustable so that it does go better for a lot of different breeds. that's the extra large and that's fitted on her properly. So this is the large. I do like the way the large fits her in the neck. See? Well, we use a good girl. I love the way that it, everything except for under her arms. And I'm going to show you why and hopefully you can see this very clearly. Do you see how these straps See how the straps come right here and they're tight underneath of her armpit it means that the breastplate coming underneath of her is not long enough if it if i pull it down if i loosen up the neck and pull it down i'm going to expose her breastbone it's not ideal so she's kind of in in between size but the extra large is more comfortable for her to run long distance in and it's safe so this fits her very nice again up here in the neck and it fits her nicely around, but the breastplate is too short. And I hope you can really see what I'm talking about here. Turn, turn. Oh, that's a good girl. Where it's really super going to rub on her if she wears this for a long distance. See? So Bumble's getting super antsy because she sees her at 